Let's catch up with the weather and Carol says snow could be on the way. Very good morning, Carol. Good morning. Yes, it certainly is. Some of us will see it sooner than others, especially in the tops of the hills. Now, we've also got some patchy light rain in the east, patchy light rain in the west, and the two will merge. And you can see quite a lot of cloud on that map as well. So a dank day. The best of the brightness is going to be in the southwest of England and also Wales. But this morning, we could still see some showers across parts of Cornwall, for example. It's a cold start and it's a cold start across Wales too. Watch out for some patchy fog and patchy fog being very prevalent this morning across parts of Northern Ireland. Here too, it's a cold start to the day. Now across the north of Scotland, there's a fair bit of cloud and we've got some splashes of rain here and there. It's the same for Eastern and Southern parts. Splashes of rain, splashes of rain across the northwest of England too. Then as we come south into the Midlands, East Anglia, all the way down into the southeastern corner, it's a cold start, but there is a fair bit of cloud around. You can see in the west where we're looking at some sunshine first thing. So as we go through the day, we continue on this cloudy note. Most of the fog will lift, some of it will drag its heels on, some of it will just lift into low cloud. Now through the day too, the highest temperatures are going to be where we've got the sunshine. Rain moves in across Northern Ireland and for the rest of us, it's going to be cloudy and dank in places. Through the evening and overnight, we still do have all this light and patchy rain across the east. Light and patchy, not all of us are seeing it. Increasingly wintry on the hills. Some rain coming in across some southern areas and more rain into the southwest. In towns and cities, it's going to be a cold night away from the southwest, but in the countryside, it's going to be even colder. Now, what's happening this weekend is we're dragging in cold continental air. It's coming in on a brisk easterly and of course we've got our weather system coming into the southwest during the course of Saturday. It's low pressure accompanied by this occlusion. As it comes in it bumps into that cold air and increasingly we'll see some sleet and snow. So on Saturday here it comes into the southwest. It will be rain initially. You can see some heavy bursts of rain in the south but on its leading edge and the northern edge of it we'll see some sleet and some hill snow. Snow across the Chilterns, for example, the Cotswolds and the Downs, but even at lower levels as it sinks south, we'll see some sleet and snow. Whereas in the north, we're looking at drier conditions with some sunshine. Now, Saturday evening into Sunday morning, we'll see some snow across the northeast of Scotland, the northeast of England, and also Kent and Sussex. That will be at lower levels as well. You could well wake up to a dusting of snow in these areas during the course of Sunday. And talking of Sunday, there'll be some wintry showers in the east, but increasingly through the day it will dry up across northeast England and eastern Scotland and it's going to be a fine but a cold day for much of the west however a new weather front coming into the northwest is going to introduce some rain some sleet and some snow and Charlie and Louise that's all heading south during the course of Monday Carol, you are lovely. Thank you very much for telling us. See you later. Thank you. Thanks very much. Steph has been out and about this week having a look at shopping centres. What's going on? How much we're buying and what are the problems?